This is going to be Shein workout leggings try on home. I have a bunch. I might split these into two videos because it's a lot. And for those of you who don't know, I started going to the gym again uh, mid mid-November. So if I get swole, just turn up totally ripped. You'll know why. These first ones are in a size small. And these ones aren't actually leggings. This is the only pair, depending on if I can find the videos, that is not actual leggings. These are like pants and they're flared at the bottom and they're gray and they have that crisscross at the top, which is super flattering. And I'm hoping this is an interesting crotch sewing technique. I'm hoping that they don't give me a camel toe because that is a problem that I have with a lot of leggings. Let's try them on. These are actually pretty nice. They fit me pretty darn well. I feel like a Clydesdale. Don't mind my Christmas socks. But they're pretty cute. They're like just barely long enough. If they were a little bit shorter, we couldn't do it. That would not be acceptable. And now, Moose chewing on her bone for your listening pleasure. I'm not gonna stop her because I love her and I don't want to make her sad. This next pair is in a size small. Probably got most of these in a size small. And they are this cool purplish tie-dye color. And they had so many different cool tie-dye ones. They had like a million different colors. And it was hard to narrow it down. So this is the... the one in like the random splotchy tie-dye pattern. This is the color that I chose and this is what they look like. The back looks super funny when they're not on because it's supposed to make your butt look incredible. Which would be nice because I just started going to the gym so my butt is like not incredible yet. We have a little help in that department. And it's not catfishing because I'm definitely not trying to date anybody that goes to my gym. That would be weird. That would be... That could go all types of wrong. Let's try them on. I could be off base here, but I don't really think they're doing me many favors. This is what they look like. This is what they look like from the side. And the back. My issue is that they are not tight enough, so they're not really doing the compression that they're supposed to, because it's kind of like loose and wrinkly up here. What the? I think we're just gonna have to deal with the revving engine because I, I don't think that my neighbors are stopping that anytime soon, so. Welcome. Welcome to the channel. Subscribe. So. Yeah, I feel like if I go for an extra small, if they had these in extra small, I think they would do better, but they're already kind of short on my ankles, which isn't my favorite. Next, I think I'm gonna try on these blue ones. They want to try on these blue ones. They are also in a size small. Let's hope that they load another less Oh, these ones feel soft. Feel nice and soft. And it's a really cool color. They also have some butt sculpting effects in the back. And they have lots of mesh. 
Oh, the mailman's driving by. He's going to see this and be like, that's okay. I gave him candy for Christmas. So. Hopefully he doesn't judge me. Anyway, wish me luck. Hopefully these ones fit a little bit better. Now there's a random dog barking. If you guys hear that. Sorry, it's not Moo, she would never, she's sweet. So, I really like the color, but I also feel like these are kind of loose and maybe the problem is that all my current leggings are really, really, really tight, but I just feel like they're not squeezing me where they're supposed to. The color is really fun though, good color. This next pair is also in a size small, so I hope it's not too loose on you. The fabric feels a little thicker, maybe. And they are gray. Nice and basic. They also have <laughs> an extreme butt scrunching effect and some little cutouts here. And there goes Moo chewing on her bone again. Well, these are my favorite ones so far. They're thick and they're pretty long. Not quite as long. <laughs> Moose like in the way. Not quite as long as I would like them. But they have the cutouts here. The bottom of the leg is actually mesh too. Now, I do think the scrunch butt effect might look a little bit crazy. It's very, very scrunchy and because of the acid wash, effect it's very obvious so you guys can tell me if it looks stupid or not but so far so far those are the best ones next i am going to be trying on another small thing it's a two pack of Butt scrunch shorts. Came with a black one and a violet one. I guess that's the shade you'd call it. I'm just gonna try on this pair because they're the same thing and these ones are more exciting. Let's try them on. Still not a big fan of high waisted stuff. These are really high. <laughs> I know all of these things were high waisted, but these were really high waisted. This is what they look like. I wonder if like I folded this down, if that would be better for me. I don't know. For the warmer weather, gym trips, you know, they do fit well though. I think out of the last two, we're gonna save this one for last because I just think it's a little bit more fun. This next one is a size small, and this is the last one, so everything in this video is a size small. And these ones are a different style of tie-dye. They kind of give like the bleach dye effect, because it's black with a brown color, and they're very boho looking. They also have a scrunch butt, but it's not as like crazy looking as the other ones. Mainly because the tie-dye kind of disguises them a little bit. Let's try them on. These ones fit pretty well, and they look pretty cool. I'll give them that. This is what they look like. And they're not too short. And they're comfy and they're thick. Not sure how good the color looks on me. But this last pair is black and yellow, black and yellow, black and yellow. It's also a different type of tie-dye. 
it have a scrunch butt? It does. It has a subtle scrunch butt. And it's like a stripey tie-dye, but it's cooler looking on the bottom. And they are nice and soft. Let's try them on. Alright, this is what they look like. I think they're also pretty cool. I really like the patterns down at the bottom. And the boot scrunch isn't too obvious because of the tie-dye and the dark colors once again, which is kind of nice. I feel like a bumblebee. That was that for this video. I honestly don't know which ones I'm going to keep and which ones I'm going to send back. I think if anything, I'm keeping the gray pair. I liked how that one fit me and looked and all that stuff. But... My question of the day is, if you go to the gym, what is your least favorite workout to do? Because right now I'm just doing the machines because I don't know what I'm doing with anything else when it comes to like form and stuff. I mean, I plank too, but that's different. Um, I really hate the one where you put your legs in it and you go like... You lift them up like that and it burns your upper thigh and then the other one where you lay on your belly and you pull your legs towards your butt that one is annoying too like those are the hardest ones for me i don't like them very much but i do them and it burns like it's like supposed to be a good burn i guess what's your least favorite workout to do and if you don't go to the gym what is something that you do mental or physical anyway i hope that you guys enjoyed thank you so much for watching i hope you have a wonderful wonderful weekend hey this is my current list of wonderful wonderful patron supporters as always thank you all so much for your continued support please send me more little requests for my extra little um blush tear videos um, this one was requested by one of you a while ago, the what's in my purse video, but any other random ideas like that, safe for work, obviously, let me know, and I'll look into it.